Hi guys, this is where my plants come to live in the winter time. These are all rose cuttings. Some of them have already rooted. There's also some seeds back there, but I'm not holding my breath on any of them. These are all my plants that go outside. This one has decided to bud. It's a form of mother of thousands. There's a couple of different, you can see it gets its little babies on the end of the leaves. They just drop off and you can put them in dirt and they'll grow. That's what's down here. See? And this right here is my amaryllis boblets. And this is my aloe plant. And this is what I found very interesting. Look. It's budded out. I did not know I'm going to have blooms on my aloe plant. And this is just all the other plants. Here's that little cactus I've been putting pictures out of. Isn't that cute? Just the cutest little thing. Other little plants, all my gnomes back there that need to be painted. And yes, the pencil tree cactus and the philodendron, all this stuff is... This is a red hibiscus right here. And it actually bloomed after I brought it back here. I'm not sure about this elkhorn fern. I don't know if it's going to make it. And then there's the plumera, which I think I'm going to either plant in the ground in the spring. It The leaves look bad because it loses its leaves in the fall and the winter. I might just take the big pieces off and stick them in dirt and let it become three other plants. But anyway, these those down there too. But yeah, that bulb back there is a grow light and of course the other ones are grow lights. But this is where they come to live. Come March, so I'll go back outside. <laughs> I will update you on blooms. All right, love y'all. Bye.